What's going on everyone? Welcome back to Power Wash Simulator. We're going to be cleaning the Holomax heater today. Hey Power Wash Services, how's it going? Hopefully you enjoyed your previous time with us and would like to come back for more silver screen jet wash action. We've got this green light for another two movies, which means we're filming back to back. For these, we're tra time traveling all over the place, back to the wild, wild west of 1885, into the far flung future of 2015 and even into a bleak alternative present. A real mind melter. Unfortunately, the first minds to be melted were those of those of the production crew. They started work on the Hill Valley Town Square of the future, built this incredible looking futuristic movie theater, but then trashed it as if it's in the bleak alternative present. You know what? I'm getting, I'm getting the feeling that I'm in danger of melting another mind here. So let's just say we've got a grubby, strange looking movie theater we'd like you to wash down in your intimidable. Inimitable? Inimitable. Excellent. Excellent fashion. I don't know what word that is, but let's get into it. Ooh, okay. I wonder what's on that billboard up there. We're going to start with that because I want to know what movie are they advertising on that billboard? Oh, there's the, uh, what do you call it? The clock tower. <laughs> the courthouse. Could not remember for a second. All right, let's head up top. Whee! Okay, jump over. I see a lot of graffiti. Calculations, maybe? Hey, Power Washer, welcome back to a small, dirty corner of the future. Or it's just a big old blank nothing. When they finished the set, the entire town square was going to look like it's 2015. If you can imagine that far forward, oh, well, believe me, it's pretty darn easy. Also, I've heard some rumors about the film's predictions. I'll run them past you once I've found my notebook. Oh, yeah, I want to see what they predict 2015 would be like. I mean, it's probably a reference to the movie, like what they predicted in the movie. But I have never seen the movie, so I would like to know. Well, I thought this was a billboard, but it looks to be just like a marble background backdrop thing, so not all that impressive. It's a grid wall, according to the description. Oh, there's a whole backside to it, too. Hmm, I wonder what's... is there anything under here? Probably not. Well, whatever... This wall is. It is clean now. So, we move on. Hey, there's a real fun trick that the special effects team have done for the movie theater. Do you want to try it out? Yes? Just stand on the special marker on the road and wait for the magic. That one over there? Ooh. Ooh, fun. Okay, okay. Less, less fun now. I like it. I like it. That was cool. That was cool. So I promise you fun predictions from the film, right? Strap yourself in. Yes, I would love to hear what you have to say. Prediction one, there will be flying cars galore in 2015. Mm, that's a That's a fun thought. Indeed. Very fun thought. Oh, I think that's for sure. I wouldn't be surprised if we had the my 1995. Ooh, you're just a little bit off the mark, sir. Just a little bit off the mark. I really hope we have the my 1995. I turned 30, it would be great to have my party in space. Well, you could potentially have your party in space in 2015. That was an option. You had enough money, you could do it. <laughs> Wait, isn't that about when NASA decided to close their space program? I don't remember. But they started to downsize and send their astronauts to Russia so they could fly out from there at some point. I don't think it was 2015 specifically, but it was very soon after, I think. And then when did SpaceX kind of become a thing? Prediction number two is hoverboards. Well, that one's correct. I believe we had the first hoverboards by 2015. Not exactly, uh... Oh, the hoverboards are a big ask, not the cars? Okay. We don't have exactly the hoverboards they have in the, the movie, but we have what are called hoverboards. I mean, skating feels like a fad already. Wheels on a plank? Come on. Mm, I don't know about that, Chief. I'm gonna miss the mark a tiny bit. Although, if we have hoverboards, surely we could have hover shoes. Now, that's a big ask. The only thing that's correct is that skateboards are out of fashion. 
or they did go out of fashion for a little bit. People did think they were dangerous and not appropriate for a lot of spaces, but I didn't read what he said. So let's go back into messages. Please let us have hover shoes by 2015. I'll be 50 and I could host a disco on a lake or something. See, now that's vision. That is a vision. I can get down with that. Or you just expand the hoverboard vision into like a hover platform. And you can still have your party on a lake. You would just require your own muscles to keep you standing, probably. Um, another prediction, probably, of theirs in like the movie. I guess is Jaws 19? Didn't quite make it to 19 Jaws movies, but I can imagine since it was a popular movie, that was a prediction for sure. The good thing is, we don't have Jaws 19 because people's opinions on sharks have changed drastically over the years. People are still afraid, but we know they're not entirely evil. Prediction 3, Jaws 19, of course. Yep. What else do you have to say about that? What What's the reasoning behind your prediction? Drew is out on that one. Okay. I'm glad you're not delusional. I mean, who doesn't want to- okay. I mean, who doesn't want to watch a shark movie? There's so much story there. Well, there's several other shark movies that have come out since, like, Megalodon. Or the Meg, I guess it's called, not, me like, the full name. The full government name. Especially if you branch to Hammerheads. Indeed, indeed. Also, we still have Shark Week. So there's still technically content out there about sharks is not exactly the Jaws franchise. But I think the maximum number of films for any franchise is three, right? Okay, okay. So we're we're on the same page. I mean, after that, isn't it all just getting a bit silly? Maybe not on the same page exactly, but... Um, definitely not another Jaws movie. That's for sure. And change up the story a tiny bit. Then you might be able to get a little bit more out of it. Out of the shark movie. There we go, we got the ceiling, we gotta take care of some lights here. Did we get all the lights? I think we did. How do we know? Entry ceiling lights. Yep, six out of six. Alright, I think we got most of this back wall except for one of these doors. Alright, so let's check the tablet, make sure... You got an entry pilaster? Which one is it? Ah, up here. Okay, that's one. What else? What else? What else is that? 98% upper side window frame. Which one's that? Oh, on here? Nope, that's the alley. Oh, that one up there. Yep, yeah, okay. So here, probably just the undersides of these. Up there. Oops. Nope, wrong buttons. There we go. What else? The th roof of the theater. That's not this. This one? This one. Hmm, I thought we got this. Alright, well that's cleaned. Don't know where that dirt was, but we got it. There's something else that was 99% above. Jaws 19 sign. Is that the main one? Probably. Yes, okay. The back of it, maybe? Alright, we got the Jaws 19 sign done. What else? I think it's just a bunch of stuff that we started. Oh, no. Keystones. Some more of these things. Which one is it? This one down here? Easy. Alright, so now we just gotta do the curb and the fire hydrant, which we'll start with. There we go. Fire hydrant done. Do the curb. Okay, we got the curb. Now we just gotta do the floor. I think this should about do it. There we go. Job complete. Let's watch the tape. Seeing the movie theater is practically sparkling. Looks great. And you've got us right back on schedule. Can't wait to see Marty's fade 
Nope, Marty's face. Once we are all set up and that shark flies out at him. I can't tell you exactly what's next, but keep your pager handy. We're probably going to need you again very soon. Thanks a lot. Alright, I think there should be one or two more jobs after that. Um, I think just one. Looking at the little circle thingy there. So, uh, yeah. Should be one more episode video after this. And thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that next and final video from this DLC. Hit the notification bell so you get notified when it does drop. Make sure to like the video down below if you did enjoy. Um, again, leave your favorite moments from this movie series. I don't really know. But, um, how many Back to the Future movies are there? Aren't there three Back to the Future movies? Pretty sure. You know what? Scratch that. Let me know if you think there should be 19 Jaws movies in the comments. <laughs> That's what I really want to know. Anyways, I'm going to get on out of here. Thank you so much for watching again, and I'll meet you in the next one.